What if I told you you could manifest anything you desire to have in three days or less? Well, I have a very specific thing that I've been doing for years now, and I also have been sharing this with my clients, and I want to share it with you. So if you're ready to know how to manifest extremely fast in three days or less, I'm going to give you the tips, the tools, and the techniques to do this. And trust me, you do not want to skip any part of this video. When it comes to manifesting anything you desire to have in three days or less, the truth is, is that most people do not have the discipline that it takes to have a strict mental diet. And when I say a strict mental diet, I mean like what Neville talks about when he says that you're supposed to basically put your thoughts, your mind, your focus all on the end, the wish fulfilled. What is the wish fulfilled? The wish fulfilled is where you refuse to look at your 3D circumstances, despite what's going on around you, you refuse to see this as the end all and be all of what you're manifesting and oh it's not going to happen for me well it never happened for me before nothing has your focus except for the end result the wish fulfilled your circumstances that you're living in in the 3d in the present moment if you do not like those circumstances that does not matter what matters when you're having a strict mental diet is that you're living in the wish fulfilled so you're thinking as if you already have your manifestation and you're ignoring what's going on around you. Now, like I said, if you can do this consistently for three days, you will see the movement that you desire to see because there is nothing outside of you that can stop you from getting your manifestation. Everything is within. I want to say that again. Everything is within you. There's no one to change but self. When you start to connect to the inner voice that is telling you that things are working out in your favor when you're focusing on hearing those inner conversations someone congratulating you you are actually in alignment with a strict mental diet and i also want you guys to know that the wavering thing that people do it's crazy because i get a lot of people asking me well how do i just like ignore my thoughts i'm not telling you to ignore your thoughts i'm telling you to stop allowing yourself to spiral you know when you like think one negative thought and instead of just like letting the thought dwindle away you're actually like starting to engage with it and then before you know it it's 20 minutes later and now you've been spiraling we want you to get back into alignment a lot quicker by not wavering against what your desire is i'm going to give you guys an example let's just say you're looking to manifest a new job or you want to have a position that pays you more money that's what everyone wants right now. Everybody wants to increase their finances. If you put yourself into the end result, would you be seeing your bank account with more money in it? Yes. Would you be going to the store and saying, I can buy that, I can buy that, I can afford that? Yes. If you put yourself in the end result of a person who already has the job that they desire, would you be preparing yourself for the day when you're doing your duties in your job? Yes. These are all the things that a person who already has their desire would be doing. So while you're in the process of manifesting your desired reality, you have to pretend, and I use the word pretend for a reason, so that you understand that yes, you are literally putting yourself as a character, as you're in the end result, thinking from that person who already has it. If you can do that consistently, for three days or less, you will start to see your manifestations come to you. I want you to test this for yourself. I have plenty of people that have tested this and they have proven to themselves that they are the operant power in their reality. Their thoughts are creating their reality. Okay, now let's also go to the technique that I showed you guys in my last video. We are talking about affirmations in our manifesting community there is a topic of interest that everyone is using right now and I think collectively we've all manifested using ASK formations. ASK formations. And what that's basically doing with your subconscious mind is when you ask your questions to your subconscious mind, it's impressing a lot faster for your subconscious mind to make your manifestations come true. Remember, when it comes to having a strong mental diet, you're not wavering away from the end result. 
And with ask formations, your subconscious mind is going to give you the result a lot faster because when you ask a question, your subconscious mind has to make sure that that becomes true in your reality. They've done the studies on this, the repetition of you saying an affirmation over and over and over. And in this case, we're doing ask formations. You're just going to see the results a lot quicker. So I suggest that you guys go back and listen to my meditation that I did a couple of days ago on affirmations. I did Isn't It Wonderful? This is an excellent way to start to train your subconscious mind to focus only on the end result. Now this is going to be very important for you guys to listen up for because I want you to understand that when you release the resistance around your thoughts towards your manifestation, that's when everything starts to really start pouring in for you. There's nothing outside of yourself that will stop you from getting your manifestation. And this is why I highly suggest a seven day mental diet reset, which is what we're doing in my monthly group coaching. It's called The Sweet Spot. We're starting September 4th. If you guys are interested in having like a collective group of people, we're all going to be manifesting our desires at once. And I'm going to be coaching you guys each and every day to stay on track to make sure that you're going to get your manifestations a lot quicker. Now, this does work like magic because the magic is within you. The magic is you speaking things into existence, keeping yourself focused, and despite what people are saying around you, saying that you can't do stuff, you have to find ways to keep yourself on track. That could be listening to music, that could be distracting yourself by exercising, meditating, but the most important thing is to keep doing your ask formations. Keep doing the things that make you feel in alignment. I love you all dearly. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Have a wonderful day wherever you are. Happy manifesting. Peace.